Well, summer is here, and at the worst possible time, we're seeing supply shortages that are impacting Valley Heating and Cooling Companies. Our Ashley Holden rode along with local technicians fighting to keep their customers cool. Almost just helping people, and then it just became something I enjoyed doing. Heath Baldry has been working in the heating and cooling business for more than two decades. Driving door to door, keeping Valley customers cool. Here's our capacitor. For now, yes, they are widely available. For now is becoming a common phrase because for Heath and his technicians, it's hard to know what will be available. Um, I used to be able to walk into one supply house and get whatever I needed for all week. Now I have to go and make five or six trips to all the supply houses around the Valley. Sometimes they even have to order from out of state. We search the entire country for parts if we have to. What's the longest wait you've had? There's a uh, uh, we're trying to get a commercial air conditioner for a certain customer and it's 52 weeks. And for this job here, they actually needed what's called flexible duct. That's this right here. They had such a hard time finding this. They actually had to go to four different places just to get the amount they needed. And prices for items keep going up. I think we saw almost 40% increase last year in air conditioning products alone. Heath has had to raise prices and they're trying to avoid that again. If they can't find the part your unit needs. We're not going to say there's nothing we can do. We uh, have a temporary air conditioner that we can bring over. Uh, we also have a company that will deliver temporary air conditioning if that's the case. But Heath urges people to make sure they're maintaining their unit, changing their air filter, and keeping an eye out for odd noises, odors, or a rise in humidity. His technicians say if you plan ahead, you'll probably have more options and not be stuck without AC. You're over 10 years old and you've made a couple repairs in the last couple years, start talking about it. In Phoenix, Ashley Holden, ABC 15, Arizona.